Want to send email from Google Sheets or Excel Sheets? Here the best free option. Yes, it's free. Log in to your Google Sheet and install the bulk mail add-on. Create template sheet. Add your data. Use Gmail Drafts as a template. And start sending. Track email open date, time and count. A design drafts in Gmail. Open browser in incognito mode. Log in to Gmail. Press Composer and start designing your draft. Write variables in curly brackets. In each email, these variables will be replaced by the data which you will add in the sheet. Write image in curly brackets where you want to put a variable image which will be different in each email. You can add images or GIF. Add them as an inline image, not attachment. Be creative. Apply rich formatting. You create the best draft according to your requirement. Now the draft is ready. Let's go to Sheets. Go to Google Sheets. Take a new sheet. Go to Add-ons menu. Click on Get Add-ons. Search Bulk Mail. Click and install this add-on. After installation, go back to Sheet. After installation, come back to Sheet. Now, go to Add-ons menu. Then Bulk Mail. Then, click Create Sheet. It will add two new sheets. One is template sheet and another is a bulk mail data sheet. Don't rename these two sheets. Right now, don't do anything in the bulk mail data sheet. Delete sample data from template sheet. After deleting sample data from template sheet, add your variable in that sheet data. Make sure that the header of the column is the same as the variable name which you entered in the draft. See, here, the variable is first name. So the header of the respective column is also first name. At the time of sending the email, the all variables of the draft will be replaced by the data which you entered in the sheet. If variables are more than available column, then simply add a new column and give the same name to the header which is in draft. You can rename only blue headers. Read note of each header before renaming. Now let's add an image ID. This image will be shown where you wrote image with the curly bracket in draft. First, upload all images in Google Drive. Take the ID of each image and paste it in Sheet. For any Google files, everything between d slash 2 slash view is the ID of that file. Just copy that. Paste in the Sheet. Do the same for all images. You can also set Google Form to easily get image IDs. Now, add image width and height. Add only if you want to adjust it before sending the mails. Leave it blank to send an image with its original size. Add send a name. This name will be shown in the receiver's inbox in bold letters. Add an email addresses into to cc bcc and reply to columns. If you want to add more than one email address then add semicolon between two IDs. You may leave CC, BCC and reply to column blank if you don't want to use. Upload attachment file in Google Drive then add Google Drive ID of attachment in sheet. If you want to add more than one attachment in single mail then add a multiplication symbol between two IDs. Add the date on which you want to send the email. 
Leave it blank if you want to send it instantly when you press run. To add in your data, go to Add-ons menu. Bulk Mail. Press Configure. Make sure you're logged in only from one account. Select the subject of the draft which you made earlier. Click Set. You can send test email of any row you want. Just add that row number and click Send Test Email. Check test email in your inbox. If it is OK, then go ahead. Status will be updated in the sheet automatically. Turn on email tracking if you want to track when the receiver opened email and how many times email opened. Press Run to finalize the configuration. Wait a while. In the receiver's inbox, these emails have arrived. You can check the status of each email in the status column. Email open date and time will be added here automatically. Great! After configuration, this sheet will check new entry or status of each row on each day. You can change this interval or change checking time from the advanced setting.